Hi everybody, it's Rachel from Sage. I'm here to do uh, yet another green look. I'm really on this green kick at the moment. This one is really a fall look. Um, it's spring, deep spring here. We're having 30 degree days where I live, 30 degrees Celsius days where I live now. But the colour story is very much that of, you know, the weather that would be occurring on the in the Northern Hemisphere. And this is a redundant palette once again, but one of my favorites, this is my daughter's birthstone palette. So she has one of these as well. This is the BH Emerald for May palette and it's absolutely stunning as you can see, very moody. Okay, let's get into it. I'm priming my lids today with the Mecca Max Zoom Stick in caramel. Let me just adjust my mirror there. I'm going to go in with that deep khaki shade called Restless first. Now I'm going to go in with that beautiful deep green khaki shimmer called Artsy AF with my finger and I'm going to place it out here on the mobile lid over the deep khaki like so. And then I'm going to go onto the middle lid and inner third with this main shade called Emerald, which is also a shimmer. Stunning, look at that. Wow. And then on the inner corner with this um, champagne shimmer called Total Package. That's it there. Just a dot and a dot there. And now I'm going to blend. I'm going to take this um, shimmer here in this beautiful green undertone brown called Hard Worker and use it as an eyeliner. And then I'll buff that out again with some more of that matte deep car key like so just sweep that around there like that 
I did the rest of my makeup pretty fast today because I just used um, my e.l.f. camo powder in powder foundation in 280N, which is light. And I've repressed this because it was all around the outside. So I've repressed it and put it in the middle. So I should be finishing that in a week or so or so. And it's the right time of year for the powder foundation for me. Good shade, as you can see. I put on my Fenty Beauty Shady Biz 02 bronzer, one of my favorites. Lots of pan in here too. Oh, well, a good pan. So the blush I used today was the Barium Heatwave Sunray Baked Marble Blush. One of my favorites. I love this. It's more of a highlighter though, you'll have to say. And over, it looks really nice over the bronzer though. So a really warming up the face effect. And my lipstick is one of my favorites, the Mellow Electro. Okay, beautiful color, beautiful formula. I just sort of used it as a tint today, a lip tint. So on my the eyes, I've put some eyeliner, liquid eyeliner on the top. I used my Fenty Beauty in truffle, fly liner in truffles or big truffles. It's the brown and these last so long compared to other liquid liners. So even though it's dearer, you get a lot of use out of it and there's a lot of product in there, it's full. You know, you don't just get like halfway. So I've gone through, I think this is my third one, but that's been over quite a few years and I really, really love this eyeliner. And I do have a black one as well, but I haven't opened it because I've got another black one open. The mascara today is just Essence Lash Princess, the volume, the purple one, one of my long time favorites. Oh, I filled in my brows, did my usual. Now that I can't get the Barry M Feathered Brow pen anymore, I've been using the Benefit Precisely My Brow in 3.5. It's good, it's good. I still miss my my pen though. And I have got found some others in other brands. I haven't opened them yet because I'm like, oh, I'll use up a bit more stuff before I do that. So this is today's look. It's very um, evening, I would say, but very much the colors of autumn. We call fall autumn here. Um, but definitely not a spring look, I wouldn't say, but it's me. It's a, it's a me look, let's face it. Have a wonderful day and I'll talk to you again soon. Thank you for watching. Bye for now.